I'm going to start up with uh, my afternoon walk and uh, let's see Leopard Cave, three kilometers, Eagle Ridge View site, three kilometers, Kuala Kuala Hike 6.4. Okay, because it's the afternoon and I don't want to be fighting the dark. I think I will end at the, uh, hopefully it's one route, Leopard Cave and Eagle Ridge View. And the funny part is that uh, it's in the afternoon, it's warm, so all the cold blooded animals would be running freely. So let's see if we shall come across any snakes. This is a big tree falling. Okay, the other helpful thing is to have a stick because if the trail is not being walked and you are the first one. You are bound to come across a lot of spider webbing that just tangles in your face. And I can tell you now that ain't cool. It ain't nice at all. And I've seen, I don't know if it's a daker, daker, they call it. I've seen two of them but they run away so quick that I don't even get a moment to capture them on camera. So yeah, even in the morning it happened. But uh, yeah, it's in the afternoon and I'm glad it is so dense. So much so that I'm walking under the shade. In a bit of elevation. And that's where the dam is, where I camped. It is 1330 minutes in the afternoon. And walking under these trees gives a feeling like it's already in the 1700 you're gonna lose light it's so thick and if you are being warned about snakes i don't know your eyes get tired because you are constantly scanning constantly scanning you don't want to step on the snake and get a bite when you are alone in such areas but uh, yeah the adrenaline the drill is what we like
Oh shit, this is what I hate. Now I must go crouching, getting under here. And what if this thing lets go on me? Hmm? Damn. What do I do? Turn back or carry on? Yes, I'm going, but it is a long drop to go down this side. If you fall down there, it's no point. It's a point of no return. So the route, the route keeps on going and there is a long drop on the left if you are afraid of heights here yeah, you will be feeling dizzy but the mere looking down I'm just keep on going and I just wonder what is it that I cannot see and it can see me but that's not my baby if I don't see you and you see me you ain't my problem If you can see through the bushes down there, it's where the dam is, where I camped, and now I'm actually doubling back because I passed the Leopard Rock Cave. I looked at it and I looked at it and self told me we are still going to find it, but yet it was indeed the Leopard Rock Cave. Cave. So I'm moving backwards now so that I can take it and capture it. So back at the Leopard Rock Cave again. This is a leopard rock cave. You can actually live in here and this is the stack of stones which create a nice room like looking space in here I should believe that this is the cave where the Kumedes were chased away by Shara Zulu and it's got a nice view if you look down there
All right. I'm gonna carry on. I'm not gonna backtrack because I discovered that there's a way that is coming back to this cave where I made a turn. So I'm gonna carry on and see if that's gonna lead me to Guala Guala. Is it Guala Guala cave or something? I don't know. But yeah. Rock caves. I'm actually at the top because that tower there, I can see it from the campsite and the 360 view so now I'm gonna carry on this way and see if we can link up with that other way I saw down there going to Guala Guala something Damn, this bush. It is so dense. I'm right under. And I've been walking for two hours. Uh, I'm now going for a third hour and the bush is so dense. Some of the other times I was asking myself, why am I out here? But it's the question that always comes and before you start, you know it's gonna come. And then you ignore it, you carry on, and then when it starts to suck, to suck, then the question comes. But I know I'm waiting for that final phase of it now, where after all the sucking part is put behind me it's gonna be the feel-good time which is going to call for another moment like this to come yeah it's camping it's driving it's hiking you can call it anything you want, but the minute you finish one, you are already planning the next one. I'm left with about a kilometer back to base. I'll see you back at base. I'm just in a dinghy paddling in the lake This is one of the coolest things you can do 
eggs here at um, Brookie Farms. I'm just taking it very nice and slow and cautious because this camera ain't waterproof. If it can fall in here, I will cry my lungs out. But uh, yeah, you can look at the scenery. Oh, sir. 